Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Angela. I am a full-time voiceover artist and audiobook narrator, and this channel is dedicated to those of you who are just getting started out in this wonderful world of voiceover. In the hopes that I can share with you some of the techniques and tips and tricks that I use every day in my own work. So today I wanted to do something that was kind of cool and different. Um, I've got a lot of people that are curious about adding voice over to video or to sync voice over to video. And they don't, their concern is, is that they don't have any kind of video software. Well, I can tell you that if you have Adobe Audition, there's a lot you can do with video in D Adobe Audition. And I'm going to show you that today. So what we're going to do is uh, we're going to hop over to my Adobe Audition in just a moment. But I'm going to take a trailer for a really cool Netflix show that I just started watching. And I know it's based on a book or, or books. I'm not sure which, so I don't mean to offend, but it looks pretty cool and it makes me really want to read the books. So um, it's called Shadow and Bone. So uh, we're going to hop over to that right now and I'm going to show you how to add voiceover to this video. So let's get to it. All right, so here we are in my Adobe Audition, and what I did, we're in multi-track, which is if you go up to File and you go to New, you can select either a singular audio file or a multi-track session. And a multi-track session is what we're looking at here. It's just what it sounds like. It's several different tracks together where you can manipulate audio, music, maybe multiple audio tracks, say for like a podcast or maybe an animation or something like that, where you have several different tracks to kind of mix together. This is what multi-track is for. So starting in multi-track, what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab the video for this trailer and just pull it over into multi-track. So let's do that now. Okay, here is my video over here. So all I'm going to do is pull this over into multi-track. And as you can see, we have the video over here. Now we can make this video bigger. So what I'm going to do is just adjust this window size so the window, so the window <laughs> is a little bit bigger so we can see the video a little bit better. So over here in the track section, we have the very top one is going to be your video reference, which is what this is here. And underneath that, we have the mix down of any kind of uh, dialogue and music together. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to use this trailer to demonstrate a little bit of a demo and to adding a voiceover track to this video. So what we're gonna do is come over here to our multi-track section. I'm gonna select track two, cause it's just, you can really select any of these, but it just makes it easier if it's just below. I'm gonna hit the record button, which arms this track for recording. And then once we hit this record button down here, it will start recording into this track. So let's give it a go. All right, and before we start recording this, I'm, I've only seen this trailer maybe once or twice, so I'm not exactly sure where the timing of the text on the screen is. So I might be a little bit off timing, but we can adjust it later, I promise you. So let's get started. I'm gonna hit record. Is this true? Can you summon light? She's real. Enemies are threatened by your mere existence. The whole world will be after you. The prize is one million Kruger. Bring me Alina Starkov. Am I a prisoner? 
all of Ravka is. Until you and I enter the fold. And destroy it from within. So no pressure. Everyone is looking at me like I'm the answer. Bring the light. Again. powerful than you or me. The two of us, together. Good girl. Now the work begins. If it goes wrong, I'll find my way back to you. How many bullets do you have? Not enough. <laughs> She realized she has only one equal. There are no others like us, and there never will be. You have no idea how much larger a role you have to play. And then we stopped the recording, and I know I was a little off timing on some of these. So what we're going to do now, I'm going to reduce the size of this video window. All right, I need to put my ears on so I can hear the voiceover. All right, let's go to first start where I, whoa, that's very quiet. Okay, now I'm going to unarm this track. And I'm going to increase the overall volume. All right, let's see what this sounds like. It's very quiet and it's a little off. So what I'm going to do is using my razor tool, I'm going to just cut off all of this excess where I'm not talking. And then I'm going to select move. And I'm going to move this track a little bit forward so it, we can get it to match up. Still too quiet. Let's raise the volume. A Netflix original series. Uh, that works. Okay. Let's go to the next spot where I'm talking and make sure this is right. Based on a worldwide bestseller. That actually works, but that's still a little bit too quiet for my taste. Let's go and increase the volume a little bit more. Okay. Let's check the next one. On April 23rd. That works. See if we get lucky and we don't have to scooch any others. We might have to. All right, let's check this one. Shadow and bone. I actually want to draw that one out a little bit more. So let's cut this and let's move this track over just a little bit. Shadow and bone. Only on Netflix. That works. That was pretty easy peasy. Okay. So now that we have our dialogue, our voiceover synced perfectly to this video, what we're going to do is we can, we can export this or save it in two different ways. We can either save it with the existing dialogue and music, or we can save it as just the voiceover which nine times out of 10, that's what the client's gonna ask you for is the voiceover perfectly synced to the video. So to do that, we're going to mute this track, the original audio. And so when we save it, all we're gonna save is where our voiceover that we just added is currently at. So it'll be perfectly synced. So let's go over to file, and then we're going to export a multi-track mix down, entire session, and then I'm gonna hit okay. Okay, great. So now if we come up over here to where our files are, we got the trailer test mixed down. That's the one we just saved. So let's open this up. And as we can see, this is only our voiceover. This is only what we just recorded. Based on the worldwide bestseller. So this is all perfectly synced to our video. So then this is what we would save and send to the client.
And there we go. There is how you can add a voiceover overlay to a video if a client needs a voiceover sync to a video, all within Adobe Audition. No need for any other video software. Adobe Audition can handle this aspect of voiceover for you. So that's pretty cool. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this helped you and I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions for me or comments, please leave them down below or send me an email. I always love hearing from you guys. Thank you so much for watching. And if you found this video helpful, hit that like button and subscribe because why not? Thank you so much for your time. I appreciate every single one of you. Have a great day and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.